Alright, welcome back to the Hardcore Pub, everybody. I'm going to be reviewing the last beer that a Beer Day with TK sent me. He's up in Finlay, Ohio. And he sent me this War Llama from Mispillion River Brewing. 16 fluid ounces, one pint. 5% alcohol by volume. This is a flavored electrolyte infused sour beer. And I do love a sour beer. So, let's see. It's a sour beer. I'm going to drink in that regular old beer glass. Why not? I mean, is there a... Every time I went to several brewers recently, when you order a sour, they put it in a... What looks to be more like a wine glass. Um, yeah, this one's got some interesting color to it. Is it St. Patrick's Day? It kind of matches my shirt. Ladies and gentlemen, Brian the Beer Snob. Let's see what it says here. War Llama is green, tart, and refreshing. Well, it is indeed green. And this, actually, for a sour, has got an incredible head on it because most of the sours that I've had, it's dying fast. I mean, these bubbles are popping super fast. Most of the sours don't really have much head to speak of. One dollar per case goes to Metaviber. I don't know what that is, but they're donating to a cause. All right, it is green. It's unusual. Not getting a whole lot on the nose, but it's the taste that I'm going for, so let me get this in and wet my whistle. Cheers. Hey, hey, hey. She's tart. She's tart, as most of those sours are. The first drink is the one that's going to punch you in the mouth. The sourness, the tartness, it's just, boom, it hits you. It gets much better. See, this head is way, way down. I have a few more sips, and then I'll let you know what I think of this War Llama. See, already, second sip, third swallow. It's fantastic. This reminds me of a, a liquid uh, Jolly Rancher. Yeah, when I was a kid, the Jolly Ranchers, they came in like the long sticks, you know, the long flat sticks. This is like a, like the green apple, the sour apple Jolly Rancher, and it's nice. It's sour, definitely not too sour. It's delicious, and now the head is completely gone. Yeah, um, I want to say, it's been a minute since I watched the guys review this. Um, I'm not sure if they liked it or not, but I like it. I like it. It's got some cool can art on it. And it's got a nice flavor. Now, sours are not a beer that I'm going to sit there and drink one right after the other after the other. For me, what a sour is, hey, Tiger, a, a sour is, it's a great beer to start off with on, on your, your day or your the, your evening when you're going to have some beers. You're blocking my view here, buddy. Um, it's a great beer to start off with, or if you've had a couple of beers and you're kind of getting that beer taste in your mouth and you want to, like, freshen things up a bit, have yourself a sour. It, it'll totally, totally change your palate, and uh, it's nice. This is a surprise, because Tiger has not been in one of my videos in a long, long time. He went on strike, I guess, but now look. He's making sure that he's seen. He's been chasing this little ball he got for Christmas. Santa brought him a little 
spiky looking rubber ball thingy. He's been chasing this thing all around the bar today. I like it. It's interesting. It's green. I'm loving it. TK, thanks for sending me the War Llama. I'll have to check because I think TK did not like that beer. Did not like this beer. And I told, you know, I, I commented on his video when I watched it and I said, well, I'd love to try it. And he says, I got another one in the fridge. I'll send it right over to you. And he did. Thank you, TK, because I like it. I think it's a great sour. Um, if sour and tart, they're similar but different. To me, this isn't so much sour as it is tart. It's got a, a tartness to it, but not like a lemon. Like a lemon would be sour. This is tart, you know, like, a, like cranberries are tart. Not the cranberries that have been mixed with sugar and turned into cranberry sauce and stuff like that. Straight up cranberries are rather tart. Um, that's what I'm getting out of this one. Yeah. I love it. Thank you. Last of the beers that I got from TK. So thank you. A beer a day with TK. Please. Check him out if you haven't already. I know you guys are already subscribed, but double check. Make sure you are. If you're not, head on over to his channel. Click that subscribe button. He's a great beer reviewer. And I will see you guys next time. Till then. Mm. I'm digging it.